Well, good morning, Interbet fans, and welcome to the Gravel Polytrack meeting. This is Wednesday, the 4th of March, and um, a very good program. I really like this card today. Uh, Shane Humby, to me, holds the key. We start off with a barrier trial at 1220, a thousand meters, and then we go to a maiden juvenile plate, Phillies, a uh, thousand meters at, at 1255. Now, I think there's an absolute two horse race. Uh, Winter Whistle, Keegan DeMello for Robbie Hill. Uh, this should be the right one. Very good barrier trial, but I like the look of Galactico first time. I thought this was an extremely good run behind Portico. The time was good, and I'm going with Galactico to end up winning the first race. Race two, um, maiden plate, fillies and mares, they go 1,200 meters, and here I like hot money. <clears throat> the favorite is retail therapy, 11 to 10, but I think hot money's got the form. She likes a poly track, and she will run extremely well, Warren Kennedy aboard her. What is the danger? Spanish Oasis, I like, there's a big find in the race, drawn two with a four kilogram claimer. This stable's about to turn the corner, and you want to be able to jump on them when they do turn the corner. Race three, um, it's a maiden plate, Phillies and Mezzo, go 1,400 meters. Palm Heart comes back and trip, got to have a big chance. But this is what I mean about when I say that um, Keegan DeMello, he's got some very good rides today. And uh, Joyful Winter, he rides in this race for Dean Kanama. I think this is the right horse. I really like the look of him, uh, of her at least. What's the danger? Number six, Cozy.com. Very good second run. Uh, Warren Kennedy jumps aboard this one. She's a difficult filly, but she should run well. Put Amber Bell in your play to number eight. Race four, Merit rated 69, 1400 meters. And uh, this is a two horse race or the field. You either go um, Final Assembly and Peter Piper. They're the two horses. Go Mellow rides Peter Piper. Final Assembly, we rode it last time, ran a cracking good race. Uh, the stable jockey jumps on it again. So those two or the field. Race five, merit rated 75 fillies and mares. They go 1,600 meters. And um, the diamonds and pearls, Shane Humby, Donovan Dillon, to me, the business. I think is absolutely the right horse here. What else is there in the race? has got a chance. Eden Gone, Glitz loves a poly. Circe, she loves a poly. She runs well there. Arabiata, um, got to have a chance as well. Dean Canemar, Keegan DeMello. Baron Noir ran a good second last time out and gets gates again. Race six, novice plate, fillies and mares. They go 1,200 meters and uh, absolute two corner contest. This winter sun's the best filly in the race and weighted the best filly in the race, but she's got to beat dive captain. That's um, a cracking good filly. She goes well on the poly. Look at her two runs before last run. Very, very nice runs. Keegan DeMello again. Different light. Warren Kennedy might be the third best. Right, race seven. A merit rated uh, 97, 1,200 meters. And here I like Mr. Fitz. He comes back from a bit of a break, this horse, but uh, Shane Humby does have a knack of bringing them back. Well, Pearl of Asia shouldn't be able to beat it at the weights, so I'm going strongly, Mr. Fitz. What else is there? There's Desolate Road's got a chance, Cold Hard Cash, Fast, um, Binary Star, good last run. Lots of horses got chances after Mr. Fitz, and even Damasio going for three in a row. Race eight, maiden plate, and that's for qualified maidens, 1,200 meters. Lord Cora is a right horse, Wendy Whitehead, Jason Gates. Uh, I think it looks absolutely home to Rome. But the dangers, King Cyrus, Craig Zaki for Andre Nell. I think there's got a huge chance in the race. Learning to fly, Tony Riblin, Sean Veal, Transonic, uh, Warren Kennedy for Dennis Bosch. And then Solicitor General, um, definitely got a chance, Kanye Sakai rides it for Julie Didma. All in all, great days racing at uh, Gravel, and you should be able to get the money with that lot.